In today's video, I'm going to show you a quick drawing application you can use on any touch-enabled device and within your browser. My name is Seti and welcome to another flipped classroom tutorial. Now on this channel, we do our very best to make educational technology easy for you. And today I'm going to show you a brilliant little drawing application that you can use to quickly sketch out your ideas or do some brainstorming with your students. Now the app is called Canvas. Now Canvas is part of Google. It's not part of the core suites. So we're going to have to type in a slightly different URL. Now you can find it by typing in canvas.com apps.chrome. Now this Chrome app is amazing when you're using touch devices. So I'm talking about Chromebooks with touch screens or any other device that is touch enabled. Now it does work within the Chrome browser and that's what we're going to be looking at today. Now let's go ahead and open up Canvas and the first thing you'll see is down the side you have a number of different brushes. Now we're going to select one of these brushes and what we can do is we can change the color. Now at the top we can change the color of our brush and we can then start drawing. Now in addition to changing the color you can also adjust the thickness. This is a very basic drawing app but the fact that it's part of Google means that it's automatically syncing to the cloud. So you can begin a drawing at home and then you can continue it in the classroom. You can also use it for brainstorming and let's say that you've finalized your little sketch or you've drawn something out on your Chromebooks you can simply export this. Now how do we export this? In the top right corner you'll see that there are three dots. Now go ahead and click on those three dots and then you can export your drawing. Once your drawing has been exported, you can now use it anywhere you want. Now, what I really like about this basic drawing application is that you can work in different layers. In order for you to change or add a layer, we're going to click on that icon in the top right corner. And now we can add a layer. This means we can have one layer for all our outlines, another layer for our coloring, and then maybe even a third layer for our shading. Now, I would love for you to show your students this application, this Chrome app, and just see how far they can take it. So now that you know about Canvas, scroll down into the comment section and let me know how you might use this in the classroom. Also, if you've shown your students how to use this, I would love to see some examples of all the artwork they've created. So by all means, drop those links in that comment section below. And on your way back up, make sure that you click on that subscribe button, give it a thumbs up, and also maybe hit that bell notification so you can get notified of new videos whenever they go live. I hope you found this helpful and I will see you in the next one.